It's official. My computer is uh, completely mixed up. Uh, the microphone inside the computer does not work anymore, but it's on constantly. Uh, the video source I have to use is not as good as it used to be, and those other video cameras I bought do not work anymore. Um, I pretty much have been on eBay. That's it. I've been gone trying to make a little extra money before the holiday kicks in. And that's it. Um, I'm just tired, run down, constantly talking about race because that's all people seem to want to talk about, even though that is not the basis of the subject in your videos. Um, that's it. I know I ain't been around tired. I look all played out, wore out. I'm talking about, I'm played out, talking about crime on Muni and Bard and, you know, I'm going to sit back in the next few weeks, since I have been on eBay, I'm going to remix that uh, movie that I did that I've been trying to find a place to put out, and I'm going to put it out on eBay. Um... Just type in the real AIX when you get to eBay. This is going to happen to correspond with the thousands of video on YouTube. Uh, so, I haven't been making videos lately. And as you see a few of these videos, I've been making comments to my own videos. Am I doing that to fill up space because I don't know what to talk about? No. Am I doing that because every now and then I go back and start reading file comments? Yes. Um, when it comes back to this series of South African videos, you need to understand the people that have not lost anything are the people who were in charge before the whole shebang went up. Um... We got the Obama bashers and Obama's, uh, Obama's, uh, was it, a uh, presidential rating. Now, Obama has only been the president how long? How long did it take for Bush's ratings to go bad? Um, now, the thing with Barack Obama is it is finally abundantly clear to the American people that the country's being run by someone other than, you know, the person who we think that we put in charge to run the country. Um, crime, hate, bootleg movies. Let's go to the bootlegs next. Um, I saw that movie Precious and almost damn near cried. Okay, shit, I did bust a tear for Precious. And um, it's one of the greatest movies I think I've seen in a long time. But I'm not saying that just because I'm black. And that's another thing. That's when you don't want to speak because you might say something that somebody said, oh, he only feels that way about that movie because he's black. You know, I'm tired of that shit. I'm tired of noticing blatant racism. I'm tired of hearing it. I'm tired of hearing it in the tone of people's voices. I'm tired of seeing it in their eyeballs. Just played out. I mean, it's like I got several different kinds of people in my corner. And I, in me, I am the United Nations of people. Um, I need something to sit on. This is killing my back and my legs. Ah, God. Okay. All right, I'm still here. One more thing. Sometimes when you do YouTube and you walk out of the frame or you pause your voice too damn long, they will cut your video off right there. I shit you not. So, everybody's looking at me and they say, I look scruffily, I haven't combed my hair and da da da. I haven't combed my hair in about two weeks. I haven't. Why should I? I'm not going nowhere. 
That's one thing about uh, perception. You know how they say uh, uh, cleanliness is close to godliness and all that. Now, if you're already godly, the hell you got to be clean, for. You get clean when you're dirty. People are stupid. They get little uh, quirks. and uh, I was watching, um, I think it was uh, Judge Patuti. And, um, was it Judge Patuti or the other one? Well, one of them damn judge shows. You know they got 500 million judge shows for people who don't go to jail. And if you're ever sitting in a real court of law, it ain't like being on Judge Mathis. It ain't like being on Judge Spatuti. It ain't like being on Judge Million. It's not like being on any of them shows in real life. So that old bullshit people see on TV, don't, oh, she was wrong. Oh, that's ghetto. Shit, you ought to go to real court and sit your ass up in there for three or four hours and watch how people really get fucked. So um, let me move on to another subject. Oh, I did the video asking people to, uh, you, know, you know, talk some shit to me or whatever, let it all out. And only two people had enough guts to put the video camera on and say what they had to say. But a lot of motherfuckers uh, sit there and still just talk shit. Same thing with the South African video. People talking about uh, black people in South Africa got it so good and they're so much better than white people and blah, 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 blah. And white people are all this and da, 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 their life is all messed up, blah, blah, blah. Now one black person grabbed a video camera and said two shits to me, period, about equality in South Africa or any place in Africa. No one black person. And YouTube was worldwide, right? Maybe blacks aren't you allowed to have YouTube in uh, you know Africa. So um, let's move on to another subject. What is all this drama with Iran and um, nuclear shit? Let's go to another subject. Healthcare. I think that we should have a public option. First of all, and I want to say this, and especially to those naysayers out there, the old Barack Obama bashers. Now, during your course of your life, how many times you've been able to go to the doctor and not worry about a bill? I think he was like, what, three or four days old? You remember when he first came out? So um, they don't make that model anymore. Nowadays, people need health care. First of all, if I'm bringing my company to America, I'm not going to hire a bunch of sick people, period. And when people have health care, when everybody's healthy, there's a form of equality right there. And I'm going to say this for those people who think, you know, I just want to get some Mexicans in health care or just another black want something for free. Understand this shit. When you hear the United States government say public option, do you hear these people saying free? in any way, shape, or form, they say their public option will be an option people can afford. You have to buy into the public option. If you have no jobs and no money, how in the hell can you afford a public option? There is no option for the public if the public got to pay for it. Free health care should be given to people. Free. FR to the fucking double E's. You hear me? Free health care. And somebody, some people said, uh, you know, you have great videos, but it gets lost in your language. This is the language I was taught in school. This is the language I was taught at home. This was the language that I was taught in the fucking United States of fucking America. Do you understand this? And one more thing. In the state of California, they're fixing it so kids of Basic means can't go to school anymore. If you got to pay for your own education, what is happening here in America again is the divide. The great divide once goes down again. And at least with health care, the divide won't be so great because people will be healthy enough to go to work once jobs materialize. But some people sit on top of Mount Olympus with a finger up their ass wishing when they snatch that finger out they shit on the rest of us and you've been too